Today I'm going to introduce you to fractions. I have a girl in my class and her name is Penny. And she was such a good girl today that I've decided to give Penny a chocolate. Now Penny can have the entire chocolate bar by herself. If we write this as a fraction, it will look like this. We call this one whole. Penny can have the whole chocolate bar by herself. But Penny is lonely, so I've decided to give her a friend. And her friend's name is Sue. So we have Penny and we have Sue. But I only have one chocolate bar. I know each girl wants a piece of the chocolate bar. So what do I need to do with the chocolate bar so that each girl can get an equal piece? I need to cut the chocolate bar into two equal pieces so that Penny can get a piece and Sue can get a piece. So I've cut the chocolate bar into two equal pieces. If I look at this fraction, it will look like this. We call this a half or one half. Each girl will get one piece of the two pieces of the chocolate bar. Now let's give them another 20. This friend's name is Tommy. So we have Penny, we have Sue and we have Tommy but I only have one chocolate. I need to cut this chocolate bar into three equal pieces so that each friend can get a piece of the chocolate. So I gave Penny a piece, I gave Sue a piece and I gave Tommy a piece. And the fraction for this one we call a third or one third. Each friend will get one piece of the three pieces of the chocolate. Let's add another friend. Now this friend's name is Ben. And Ben really wants a piece of the chocolate bar as well. So I've got one chocolate bar. I have four friends. So I have to cut the chocolate bar into four equal pieces. Let's have a look. Penny will get a piece. Sue will get a piece. Tommy will get a piece and Ben will get a piece. What do you notice of the pieces each time I add a friend? The pieces become smaller and smaller and smaller. And the fraction for this one we call a fourth or one fourth. We can also call this one a quarter because each friend will get one piece of the four pieces of the chocolate. I'm going to add one more friend and this friend's name is Laura. So let's add Laura to the class. So I have five friends. I only have one chocolate. I need to cut the chocolate into five equal pieces. So each friend is getting a piece of the chocolate bar. Let's have a look. So can you see that the pieces are becoming smaller? Because in the beginning, Penny had the entire chocolate to herself. And that was quite big. But now she's only getting a small piece of the entire chocolate bar. And the fraction for this one is called a fifth or one fifth. I hope you will remember the fraction. If I wake you up in the middle of the night, you must be able to tell me what we call each fraction. I hope you had fun. Until next time.